Donald Trump's proposal to incorporate figures like Elon Musk and RFK Jr. into future administrations is a bold gambit aimed at resonating with the public's hunger for change and innovation. With many Americans disillusioned by the entrenched power structures they feel have failed in the nation, this move suggests a shift towards a government more attuned to the people's needs. I read that Elon Musk said that he would accept a position in your cabinet. Would that have to do with artificial intelligence? So if Elon you chose and I him? have a great relationship. It's, he's great. He is a totally unusual character. Do you know Elon? I don't. He's great. And he's smart. And we have to cherish our geniuses. You know, we don't have too many of them, right? But he is a, a brilliant guy. And uh, what he really would like to do is get involved in cutting some of the fat. And he does know how to do it. And he loves the country. You know, it's just an amazing thing. We had a conversation the other day. You would know better than me, but I hear it had hundreds of millions of people. I heard it had the biggest audience that there's ever been. I mean, would you say that's a correct statement? I would absolutely there's say that's There's never correct. been anything even close. I heard 750 million people. I mean, numbers that are crazy. And um, yeah, he, he wants to be involved. Now, look, he's running big businesses and all that. So he can't really, I don't think he'd be free cabinet. I put him in the cabinet, absolutely. But I don't know how he could do that with all the things he's got going. But he can sort of, as the expression goes, consult with the country and give you some very good ideas. Like on AI, there's nobody knows more about it than Elon. Mm -hmm. It's a big, you know, big thing. And he said it's very important. I mean, it's very important for the country. If we don't do it, China's going to do it or somebody else, but most likely China. And China is working right now to develop massive electricity, a flood of electricity, a massive flood of electricity. And we don't because we have people that don't even, they're not even thinking about that. Yeah. And you have to. We have to win this election. This election is going, November 5th will be the most important day, in my opinion, in the history of our country. Because if our country goes the wrong way with this election, I think this country is doomed. Elon Musk, with his reputation for efficiency and forward thinking, could symbolize a push toward a leaner, more effective government. His business acumen might be leveraged to cut the fat, streamlining operations, reducing waste, and ultimately saving taxpayers money, an appeal to fiscal responsibility and conservative values. On the other hand, RFK Jun's potential role in public health could signal a pivot towards a more holistic, perhaps populist approach, emphasizing transparency and responsiveness over bureaucratic control. His involvement might attract those wary of mainstream health policies positioning him as a figure who embodies the authenticity and responsibility that many feel is lacking in today's political landscape. The combination of these two figures, Musk's innovative pragmatism and RFK Jr.'s populist appeal, might suggest a government willing to challenge the status quo, responding more effectively to the real needs of its citizens rather than being bogged down by inertia. Their inclusion could also highlight the tension between freedom and responsibility, hinting at a balance between strong leadership and the protection of individual liberties in a more just society. Public reaction to this potential cabinet reflects a mix of hope and skepticism. Trump's supporters, eager for change, might see this as a powerful statement of intent, a promise of drastic action to tackle the nation's most pressing issues. Yet. There's also the possibility of cognitive dissonance among those who are skeptical of Trump, but intrigued by the idea of Musk and RFK Jr. taking on significant governmental roles. This could represent a broader cultural shift, one that values leaders willing to defy the norm and meaningfully confront the challenges of our time.